yeah hello so this is another setup for um, this drill right here this drill right here this drill is a uh, sorry um, is is rated for 1200 watts drill so this is the drill so this electric motor right here i'm powering the electric motor from this small inverter using a car battery so this is the arms it is consuming while powering this um this um around i'm um, sorry around uh, 3.6 3.6 then 4.5 so and it's also charging this battery so i'm not using any conventional power i'm only using this small inverter so i'm going to power up this drill right here because um this has not been turned to my transformer right now so it's charging the battery now right now it's charging the battery it's charging the battery so the vote of this battery is um let's check the voltage the voltage of this battery is uh i've been powering it for a longer time now so it's a uh, 15 point um 15.82 then this one has been charging also has been charging for a longer time so i don't need to check this one so you will notice that sorry you will notice that once i power this drill right here you will look at the amps so this is a 1200 watts drill as you can see So you can see all the setup here, the modified motor. So I'm using from this inverter. So this inverter right here, let, let me off it so you can hear. So this inverter right here is powering this electric motor. I'm using this electric motor as a transformer to spin this drill. This drill is um is a DC drill. Most people know this. Uh, sorry, a DC grinder. A DC grinder, and it works effectively. I've used it to, to grind things. So let's do a load a load test on it. So and be careful. So it is a drill that has caught this. So, be watching the amps. Be watching the amps. Very hot. So with the loading with the loading I'm, I'm using only 10 10 amps from the battery 10 amps from the battery i'm using only 10 amps from the battery so let's let's times it let's just say approximately i'm using a 12 12 amps so let's check the battery to you know the voltage so it's around 15.8 so if it times 15.8 times 12 you will know the wattage it will give you a, that is around 100 and something also and 100 and something also so we are we are we are just using about 100 and something watts to power this drill right here to show you how efficient this thing is ordinarily this inverter cannot power this even cannot even power <laughs> even even this motor right there which is 1.5 horsepower this thing ordinarily cannot power it so i'm getting excess power and those people who who probably have this type of uh, cutting machine and some other equipment that are using a bigger gen just with this inverter this battery this setup and this setup you are done so that is just how it operates and this is a car battery it's a car battery and and you are also charging the battery here for free for free so thank you subscribe to this video and if you have any questions on the training or whatsoever and if you want to support this project for this project many people have invested into the project supported me one way or the other so if you're interested in the training or to support or to ask any question which i know i can answer i'll be able to answer thank you so much and please do subscribe to this video press the bell notification button like this video and share it to your friends so they can see the wonder of this device thank you so much